Hello and welcome to the Tech Creatic YouTube channel. The best laptops are capable enough to tackle your day-to-day -day work, comfy enough to use all day, and power efficient enough to ensure you won't run out of juice unexpectedly. Finding the best laptop for you can be tricky because you've never had more choices. You can get a compact, speedy 13-inch ultra portable for not a lot of money, and those who can afford to spend a bit more have access to a smorgasbord of the best laptops a new laptop could be in order if you had to prepare this year. We depend on our computers to manage our life, including work, school, ordering needs, paying bills, and keeping track of our will look here if you want a new laptop reasonable rate. You will get the laptop of your choice. So, after research and technical advice Tech Creatic lists the top best laptop of 2023, you can buy so let's start. Top 3 Best Laptops of 2023 You Can Buy Today Number 3. Acer Swift 3 Intel Evo Thin and Light Laptop The Acer Swift 3, 2021, is almost painfully utilitarian in its design. It's cased in aluminum and a magnesium aluminum alloy though coming in a not very exciting gray colorway. Acer offers a few jazzier options with a blue or orangish colorway, but those colorways are only for specific configurations the display may be the Acer Swift 3, 2021, S1 saving grace. It's a reasonably bright display, and the anti-glare finish makes it delightfully easy to see. We've used it extensively outdoors in bright conditions, and we never really struggle to see what we're doing as we do with dimmer or glossy displays. The bottom firing speakers are actually among the best we've heard in a laptop and get loud enough without getting grating or tinny. The Acer Swift 3, 2021, is certainly living up to its Intel Evo certification. The Acer Swift 3 shows solid numbers in our tests. Single core performance is strong for a laptop and multi-core performance is no slouch, though we've seen the Ryzen 7 5700U offer improved multi-core performance thanks to its extra cores. It's a monster in our battery life benchmarks, lasting 14 hours and 31 minutes in our PC Mark 10 battery life test, and just passing the 9 hour mark in our video playback test there aren't a lot of extras to get excited about with the Acer Swift 3, 2021. Pretty much the only way it goes beyond the basics is with a thin fingerprint scanner that we get to work about 1 in 10 times we use it, not so unusual in our experience with laptop fingerprint scanners. The Acer Swift 3. 2021, makes the capable performance more accessible than a lot of its Ultrabook competitors. It's a speedy Windows machine, and has a reliable display and battery. But it's packaged in an unfortunate design that looks bad, feels worse, and might be the most liquid vulnerable we've seen. Number 2. Apple MacBook Pro 13-inch M1 the Apple MacBook Pro 13-inch is still a great laptop and holds its own against newer laptops. The MacBook Pro 13-inch launched in 2020 with the M1 chip, replacing previous Intel processors that used to power Apple computers and ushering in a new era of Apple computer technology. The Apple MacBook Pro 13-inch is still superior to the early 2020 model it replaced because of the impressive tech upgrades it received. It's 2.8 times faster than the earlier model, three times as quick as comparable Windows laptops, and has a longer battery life than the earlier 2020 model. The MacBook Pro 13-inch M1 2020 is one of the most exciting releases from Apple for a while, thanks to its M1 silicon brains, but you probably wouldn't think that when you first get it out of the box. That's because with its dimensions of 0.61 by 11.97 by 8.36 inches, 1.56 by 30.41 by 21.24 centimeters, and a weight of 3 pounds, 1.4 kilograms, it's pretty Apple would probably argue, along with some of its fans, that the MacBook Pro 13 inches design is perfect, so there's no point changing it. In a fair way, this is still a good looking laptop after all the keyboard is the same magic keyboard as the one introduced with the MacBook Pro 13 inch from earlier this year. This was a welcome change at the time, as it replaced the controversial butterfly switch keyboard, the screen is also unchanged, with a retina resolution of 2560 by 1600. This results in a sharp image, 
But again, Apple is being outclassed here by rivals in our time with the MacBook Pro 13 inch M1 2020. We have been impressed by its performance. Apple talked a big game about the M1 chip and claims that its CPU is 2.8 times faster at building Xcode projects and delivers twice as fast vector performance in Affinity Photo, plus 5.9 times the 3D title render speeds in Final Cut Pro and 2.9 times the performance in Shadow of the Tomb Raider thanks to its GPU. At the time of its release, Apple claimed that the MacBook Pro 13-inch M1 2020 has the longest battery life ever in a Mac promising a huge 17 hours of wireless web browsing and up to 20 hours of video playback, a whopping 10 hours more than the previous model. The MacBook Pro 13-inch M1 2020 is the most exciting laptop Apple has released in years. The new M1 chip offers exceptional battery life and in our testing performance has been excellent. Number 1. Dell XPS 1393 10 Laptop The Dell XPS 13 2020 is a beast of a laptop. Dell's bold decisions and unwavering devotion to innovation are to thank for this. The Dell XPS 13 10 remains an excellent ultra portable, but of course, there's plenty of competition in the 13 inch space. The latest 9310 model doesn't make any radical changes, merely updating the Intel Core processors to the latest 11th generation, Tiger Lake, and adding a variant with a 3.5K OLED touchscreen. Design-wise, the XPS 139310 looks identical to last year's model, with a compact footprint, 295.7mm wide by 198.7mm deep, and a slim profile, 14.8mm at the back, tapering towards the front. The weight, as before, ranges from 1.2 kilograms for non-touch models up to 1.27 kilograms for variants with a touch screen. My review unit had the highest resolution display available 4K plus slash UHD plus, 3840 by 2400 pixels, 338 PPI. The IPS touch screen, which is protected by Gorilla Glass 6, offers 500 nits maximum brightness, is certified for displayed 400 and supports 100% of the sRGB color gamut and 90% of DCI-P3. Despite an anti-reflective coating, it's moderately shiny. My Core i7-1165G7-16 GB RAM-512 GB SSD review unit felt snappy in general use, especially when running typical knowledge worker workloads such as document creation slash editing, spreadsheets, and photo editing. Graphics performance, powered by Intel's integrated Iris A graphics, was creditable too, and a distinct improvement on the Iris Plus graphics in the previous generation model. Battery life for the previous generation XPS 13, based on a core i7 1065 G7, with a 4K Plus slash UHD Plus screen, came in at about 12.5 hours on a diet of mainstream productivity workloads. Once performance and battery life are taken care of, a laptop's usability largely revolves around its screen and keyboard, and the placement of its ports. We've covered the high-resolution, minimal bezel 4K Plus slash UHD Plus IPS touchscreen, which is a pleasure to work with, and much the same can be said of the keyboard laptop speakers used to be something of an afterthought, but no more. With more remote workers spending time on video calls and needing to relax with streaming media during downtime, a good audio subsystem is a must for a usable laptop these days. The XPS 13 9310 delivers plenty of volumes given the compact chassis, although bass is inevitably less rich compared to systems with more physical volume to work with. I tested the model, which comes with a 1.5 GHz Intel Core i7-11 generation processor, 16GB of RAM, a 512GB M.2 NVMe SSD, an Intel Iris Plus GPU, and a 1920 by 1200 touch display. The XPS 13 is a showstopper on the outside and inside. The frost white anodized aluminum finish on the lid is nice to the touch and looks fashionable when I put it in and take it out of my purse. The gleaming Dell logo resembles a fashionable brooch with just the perfect amount of glitz. So it's one of the best laptop of 2023. For more information, follow the links in the description.
If you are new here, please subscribe to my channel and like a videos.